successful drive for Florida helped. Remember, they were backed up early with the penalties and then helped with a couple penalties. 28-yard effort by Caleb Sturgis. He's a perfect five for five this year, and he's now six for six out of Chaz. Hilton will hold. Josh Jasper will kick it. The equivalent of an extra point distance. It's 18 yards. And the kick is up and good. And we are tied. Yep. Tebow back. Goes deep. He's got a man wide open. Backs up in the end zone. Riley Cooper, his roommate. Interesting. That was not a called quarterback draw. That was a called pass. Well covered by the LSU defense. Sturgis, one of two tonight. Missed from 25. Chaz Henry is the holder. That one is good. At South, South Carolina, Florida International, and then Florida State. Final 14 seconds. Tim Tebow's got helmet hair. Well, Tim Tebow has everybody's respect in this yep. league. I've never heard anybody say anything bad about him. The defensive players have so much respect for him. Uh, 12 of 17 this year. <laughs> 16 of 18 a year ago, including the game winner in overtime that gave LSU a 9-6 victory. This one gives LSU an early lead. McCarron, one of five to start, now six of ten, and it's first and goal. Kelly Johnson is in motion. They'll keep it on the ground with Lacey, and he moves it the way in for the touchdown. Uh, didn't even get knocked down. That was as good a drive as you'll see. That's Lacey who comes to the near side, the running back. Three split wide left. Blitz from the corner. McCarron steps up, heads for the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama. <laughs> To Alabama. They'll give it to Hill and they just have. Yeah. LSU threatened to take the lead. It's into the corner. Touchdown Landry. First and goal at the three. Straight ahead is Robinson. He walks in. Touchdown, Mississippi State. They go 20. This front line defense can get a three and out here to open the third. Prescott on the keeper. And Dak got a couple, and the ball is out. They might do better than a three and out. They're going with Daniel Hunter to the end zone. Well, Quan Alexander came in and ripped that ball out. Dak Prescott, a big physical guy. Dak Prescott, a run all the way, and he's got a big opening. And a stiff arm, Dak Prescott. This is what he does better than anybody in the SEC. Touchdown. Deronia Wilson got the last block. And 56 yards for the score. I don't understand. 
He's in trouble. Gets out of it momentarily. Now throws. Wide open. Jamie Ann Lewis. He might take it. Yes, he will. Another Mississippi State touchdown. Same play. Hilliard, same play. Touchdown. One yard. Per yard, uh, per pass in the country, but uh, not tonight. Harris going long. Got a man. Touchdown. Malachi Dupree. Second and ten with 134 left. Going to the end zone. Caught. Touchdown. Oh, boy. <laughs> Will Redmond ends the game with an interception on the final play. So number eight goes down to Owens right. Also yeah, that's drafted. right. On third down. Oh, one-handed grab by Dupree. Nope, nope, Was nope. he out of bounds? That is the ruling. At the review, the receiver had possession of the ball with one foot down. Touchdown. Malachi Dupree. No help. Jalen Collins again. There it is. To the five, stiff arm. Touchdown, Amari Cooper. This is for the tie. 27 yards out. We are notched. So Derrick Henry is the running back. Cooper wide to the left. Sims this side. DeAndre White touchdown. Here's Jennings. Pulls up, lobs it into the end zone. It is tipped and incomplete. And Alabama in overtime with a wonderfully conceived drive for the time field goal to set up the OT. Prevails. I thought Jennings could have ran for the first down. It's very good on the screen. Here's a quick throw out to Reed. Reed made one man miss and down the sideline is Dominic Reed. Nobody's going to catch him. Touchdown Arkansas. 52 yards on the hookup Allen to Reed. Goes to Alex Collins straight up the middle and Collins on the run. They won't catch him. Alex Collins is going to take it all the way to the house. Touchdown Arkansas. 80 yards. The LSU fans in shock, about to be down 14 to nothing. Well, we talked about the size of this. They're five yards away from another one. Second down and four, they can get a first down at the one. Sprinkle will come in to play fullback from his tailback, uh, tight end position, I should say. And it's a little quick opening draw to Collins, and he's in. Touchdown, Razorbacks. So they turn the fumble. Your screen on third down and goal. Harris waits, fires into some traffic. Touchdown, Malachi Dupree. Well, he wasn't throwing to Malachi Dupree, but Malachi, Malachi caught it. He was throwing to an up receiver, and the ball got deflected by Doral, and Malachi Dupree was in the right place at the right time. Here he is. That's touchdown number 17 of the year. Four net 
from two yards out. And we're down to a one-score game. Tell you what, They've all started together all year long, so they do have great chemistry, and that really helps a quarterback and a tailback. And here comes an end around, and it's Cornelius, and he got the edge, and Cornelius down the sideline. He might take it. Cornelius, nobody's going to get him. Touchdown, Arkansas. Lift it up. So Arkansas, a winner on the road over LSU. Must Miles, 31 to 14 is the final score. Hurts rolls to his right. He'll keep it. He's got it. He's at the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama. Kendall Beckwith is the... Cooper Bateman is the holder. Adam Griffin, 25 yards away. Cole Mazza will snap it back. Ten zip. 30 seconds to go. Alabama has now won 21 in a row. Last loss at home to Ole Miss a year ago, September. And they have defeated LSU for the sixth consecutive time. Nick Saban. Ed Orgeron. And it's time now for the, the fullback to lead the way. And here they come with Geis. Touchdown LSU just like that. And for Darius Geis, touchdown number 10. Dangerous throw back across his body now setting up a field goal opportunity for the Florida sophomore kicker. The Gators on the board. 36 yard field goal makes it first down and 10. Appleby's going to throw on first down. Got a man open, hangs it a little bit, but complete and free down the sideline. Cleveland, the freshman, headed for the end zone. That is 98 yards. First down pass. A gutsy play call by the Gators. And they move ahead for the first time today. For the tie, and it's good. Delahousse, a 22 yarder. Deadlocked at 10. The stakes. Minutes. They took off the clock with that drive. 69 yards. And now Eddie Panero is on the field in an attempt to put the Gators in the lead. Back in the lead, I should say. 26 yarder. So Florida leads it with four and a half minutes to go. The Gators four and a half minutes away from me to attempt this 34 yarder. Already he has made one from 36 and another from 25. This would put the Gators up by six and it would force LSU to play for a touchdown down the stretch. This would be a big three for the Gators. Pulled it. Got it. So it's a six point Florida lead in three six. seconds. Guys over the top. No signal. No signal. Florida says they stopped him. They spot the ball short of the end zone. Florida hangs on. Florida goes back to Atlanta.
What a stop by the Gators defense. And Jim McElwain is exuberant. What a job he's done. He becomes the first coach in SEC. History. High snap. The feed to Chun. No, Silvers keeps. Touchdown, Trojans. Silvers on the jumper. On the touchdown. Set up as the teams were already in the locker room for halftime. Well, Gassi has missed already tonight. Did he get it? It got oh, him! him. Oh, wow. Wow. It got <laughs> off the crossbar and through for the true freshman. Right behind my fullback, number 45, Zach Weldon. High snap. Chun. Touchdown, Brennan. Man open. Touchdown. Down three scores. Going to take a shot at the end zone here for Gage. Did he make the catch in the end zone? Yes. Edling finds Morrow. Ball comes out, but he got in. Touchdown. The biggest win in Troy football history. 37-year-old head coach Neil Brown out to shake hands with Ed Orgeron. They upset Missouri back in 2004, but that was at home. This is a win on the road against a top 25 opponent. At the 15, Najee switches sides. He had the big play to get them where they are. They fake it to him and come up throwing. Touchdown, Alabama. Henry Ruggs. Flag flies in at the end, but I think it's going to be Jones on the snap, and they missed the extra point. This will be the same setup from 23 yards on the field goal. This one's clean. It's up, and it's good. So Bullibus from Tagovailoa steps up, fires to the end zone. Got it! Irv Smith for the touchdown. trying. Tagovailoa flushed out of the pocket. He'll run with it. He's got the first down and more. Still on the run. He is gone. Touchdown Alabama. 44 yards. And he's holding his knee again at the end of the SEC recruiting right uh -huh. there. Yeah. Damian Harris straight ahead touchdown Alabama. From a yard out. And he's basically saying that's it guys. Bye bye. You're going to be 7-2, and two, we're going to be 9-0. and oh. Give you a lot of good players on your team. <laughs> Helps. Helps a lot. Give me a hug, coach. A little love. We're the West champs. We're heading to Atlanta. We'll head back to Tuscaloosa. Where we'll meet Mississippi State next week here on CBS. Ed Argeron's got the right thing going on here, though. They just need some more players. Some more playmakers and definitely not enough offense tonight. That was going to be their worry. We knew that coming in. Could they score enough points to opt?